Hello and welcome back. It's Double O Debbie, and this is episode six of Ocean Block. <laughs> and today we're back here on our island in the middle of the ocean, and we're ready to get getting getting stuff, <laughs> more stuff. So uh, I want to today to go to the west side of the island and see if there's anything interesting over there. I'm sure there is. What the? How is there a chicken? <laughs> there's just chicken. I don't get it. Where did it come from? Huh. What is that circle down there? Can't can't see underneath. It. <gasps> Look at that. It's a dome. Huh. I wonder if there's anything in it. I hate to like I don't think I could make it all the way down there. Maybe that's, uh, another, another day exploration. Well, there is something interesting. Maybe we can get, uh, a sea moth and go down there and check that out. Uh-huh. I also emptied a lot more of my inventory. I don't really want the raw chicken. I want stuff. <laughs> I want stuff. Leather and lily pads. Oh, I need to make that backpack. Ooh, two iron. Nice. We're, st we're still young enough. <laughs> the two iron gets me excited. Ooh, that looks like a purple barrel all the way over there. And over there, too. Another dark fridge. Oh, look at that. Um, I've seen a couple of those, but I haven't been brave enough to go down there because uh, they have guardians. I mean, I went down and got close, but... They have guardians, and, and I'm, I'm not equipped to handle a guardian just yet. Hey look, there's another golden barrel. Ugh. Oh, let me up. Let me up. Ugh. Purple barrel. Oh! An ender pouch! And luminous glass. Oh, that is sweet. It used to make a sound. Purple barrel, good. Another bed. So where was the other purple one? Oh, I, I, don't, I can't see it from here. Well, let's go to the gold one. Oh, there it is over there. The tiny ship. I wonder... I was going to say, I wonder if I can open that from the boat, but... I don't know if I... Oh! Come back! <laughs> A starfish gain extra experience from hitting enemies. Nice. Oh, this is a, an elite rarity. Boop, boop, boop. All right, let's go check out the purple one. Oh, no. Oh, that's not a purple one. That's a black one. Those only drop sea pickles. Uh. I gotta see. I gotta make sure. <laughs> Even though I've only ever gotten sea pickles. Yep. Oh, 
I'll save you, sea pickles. I saw something. I think that's another black one over there. Oh, look at the hat on that one. Oh, that's Steve. Oh, pulsating. Pulsating. Six shulker shells. You can make a shulker upgrade for a crate. Oh, that's that's pretty. That was a pretty good one. It's gonna be hard to top that. Well, we're going into the lukewarm ocean now. Tempted to get this because it's it's all together. Fourteen. It's nothing to not too shabby for one one smack. Uh, I think that's another black one. No, that's a pulsating one. Woot! Ooh, a golden, an enchanted golden apple and a diving mask. Two Gaia spirits. That's pretty top end stuff. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I don't know. Hmm, is that a black one or another pulsating one? I wonder if the if they're more the more rare ones are more common the further away you get. Oh, that's a black one. I don't know though. Uh because I mean even the Normal ones are okay because you can get iron to break it down and, and at least be something useful. Is that a black one? I think it is. It is a black barrel. Let's check. Yeah, it was a sea pickles. A sea pickle. Oh. All right, this will be our last one. Well, that was pretty good. We got shulker shells enough for three shulker boxes, which is pretty awesome. I think it's pretty awesome. Oh heck, let's just stop and get this one. Well, I was up there. I don't know how I got up there, but. up there. Wood and a music disc. There we 
go. That was uh, that was pretty good. Oh, and we got the Ender Pouch. Can't forget about that. dome the dome that we can go check out later it's gotta have something in it right almost directly west of our place. It is directly west. So that's cool. That is cool. So I got know if they're big plans, but I got plans. I got plans. Boop. Hey, I landed that. Landed it. And I put a bale of hay under there. <laughs> Just because I can get the smoke. In case I can't see the beacon. Oh, I'm full. Duh. Why is it dark? again. I don't know what stuff spawning <laughs> while I'm here. That is rather perturbing. It's all squeaky. It's old. I need to retire it. It's had a good life. <laughs> oh, God. What have I had? I've had it for years now. It's all wore out. There we go. There's gotta be some way to stop that. Okay. Okay, get my stuff out. You know what? I'll keep the ender pouch, even though it's worthless right now. Because I don't have uh, a network set up or anything. But it will be. Okay. Gotta get my farming done. Uh, I do want to still build up a bigger escarpment over here. Maybe push these steps back a little further. Get a little bit bigger of a garden over here. That'll be nice. That'll be nice. I might as well chop this down.
trying to get another stack of uh, saplings. Oh, I moved stuff. Um, I got my, my other heat source, so now I'm not going to burn myself because I can get up on this, run into it, and it's not going to hurt me. Now, I think I can still... Huh. It's not hurting me. Huh. I thought the magma blocks hurt you if you walk over them when you weren't speaking. So... <laughs> It's, it's a little bit better than a campfire, but it's still not considered a high temperature. Uh, but if you look, the processing time for uh, cobblestone is down to 53 seconds, which with the campfire, it was over two minutes. So that's much better. Much, much better. Uh, and I, I went ahead and automated this. It's just a hopper. And I made another big crate because uh, the chest was just too small, too small. <laughs> and I had to make a gold uh, cast for an ingot cast. And I just put a lever on there and that automates the, the faucet. And I've used like 200 millibuckets smelting up all this stuff. Which isn't too bad. It's not a lot of stuff. Uh, I would like to never have to smash stuff with the hammer again. <laughs> Ever. That's the goal. That's why today we're going to work on getting a pulverizer and a lapidary. And a lapidary is a generator. A lapidary dynamo uh, from thermal... This is a new one. I haven't seen this one before. And it takes gems. Because uh, once you once you get to the gold mesh and you're uh, sluicing your gravel, you start getting sapphires and rubies, which are just for uh, Project Red, for tools. Um, you need to make ruby seeds to make <laughs> honestly I don't know it's not really they don't really even have the tool recipes in there right now so that's weird uh-huh so we're getting lots of stuff I, I finally used mm -hmm. up <laughs> the last of that gravel. Oh, and I made our high temperature uh, block, which was just another magma block underneath uh, the dripper with lava in it. Took it a while to, to actually turn. Okay, so let's get snapping. I think I'm going to have to convert one of the redstone clusters I'd rather do it in the pulverizer because it'll get more uh, potentially made a little bit extra uh, lava because I could I keep meaning to leave those down there. I need to bring the crafting table down here or just make a new one and put it down there. Maybe I'll do that. Can't hurt to have more crafting tables. Oh, look at that. Boop, boop. I honestly don't know. You're not supposed to go there. <laughs> Oopsie. So let's get a pattern and we'll make make a crafting table to go down there. Oh, if I could 
get another stack of wood. Another stack of wood. And let's put it right there. Boop. And now to see that inventory. And that'll be where all of our good stuff is. Okay, so pulverizer and a power source. Oh, flint. Um, we should have gotten flint. Yeah. Okay, so don't have, I don't think I have glass down there. Might need to get to smash some sand for glass. Okay, let's see what we can do. Oop. Um, what? Sheet frame. Pulverizer. Does take a gold gear. Oh, I'm going to have to process some of that lapis. I forgot about that. We got gobs of it. One. Okay, I need two. Definitely don't want to process the lapis in that. Unless you absolutely have to. Okay. All right, there we go. Uh, that's going to help us with um, diamonds as well. Because you have to, well, you don't have to process them in the pulverizer, but you get more. Oh, I'm going to have to make. Yeah. I'm going to have to make a wrench. There we go. So take. Dang it, lag. Leave me alone. Pulverizer and then take half of those. Oh, wrong one. Hello, Sheepa. Goodbye, Sheepa. <laughs> Definitely want to automate this. Let's 
let's see. This will be really beneficial when the pump can be automated, when the water can be automated, and it'll be fully automated, and just hook that up to it. But we gotta have diamond for that. And I've only got three diamond chunks. We need at least seven to get the diamond uh, sluice and the diamond mesh but that's that's what I wanted to make today the pulverizer and the lapidary um, if we had time I was going to I was going to try and make it like a tiny passive mob farm. Like, I don't want anything super big. I wonder, do I have to have two things of blessed earth? Or is it just one? I don't know, like a cow is too long, so are sheep and pigs. I really want a cow so I can get milk and get another quest done. But, let's see. Let's go out here. Let's go to this one, it has a little awning. Or I guess I could put it on the slime while I wonder if I have to be close in order for them to spawn. I don't think so. But it might, might not be loaded all the way over here. Maybe I should go to this one over here. Ah, uh, let me out. Oh, I guess I should have. See, I don't know if that's, that's going to let them spawn. It's too far away. I don't know.
Isn't it working? Maybe they need bigger than two. Maybe they need a two by two. I don't like that tree form being so close to the path. Oh, there's a bunny. We hmm. should. Sheepy, you made it. Chicken. Where's my cow? No offense. Let move off. Let let others come join the fun. <laughs> Piggy. Nice to see you, Piggy. Okay, where's the cow? No, I want a cow. Me cow. Give me a cow. No, that's a sheep. <laughs> that's not a cow. Oh, I just want a cow. Let's can I, can I milk this? <laughs> no. Dang it! There's my cow, too. Give me a cow. Yay! Okay. <laughs> it's not irresponsible. I'm just curious. Will they keep spawning? <laughs> what are you talking about? some quests to turn in. We got the milk one, we got wool, and another milk bucket. Um, then, whoa, we got pulverizer, machine frame, and lapidary dynamo. A garden cloche. Nice. 
an Eternium helmet, and a building wand. Oh, there's still more. Immersive engineer. Oh, we got the garden cloche. An enchanted book. Paper two. Four garden cloche. Nice. There we go. <laughs> well, we. It was a small episode, but we did accomplish great things. We got the pulverizer. We got redstone. Uh, we got stuff. Now I just need to did that, that process the whole thing. Now I need to uh, go ahead and process all this. I think I'm going to keep that sand and turn it into glass. Uh, just for this one. Because I'm really low on glass at the moment. There we go. That can be smelting up and stuff. So yeah, uh, I know it seemed like a small thing, <laughs> pulverizer. Um, let's take that out too, because I want to move that. I want to move this over here. Um, There. Now I need to get some item pipes. Nah, this one. I just need one item pipe to automate this. You want to make it come out the top. Got a sack of coal, but we need to process tons of gravel to get seven diamonds. So that's what I'm going to be doing in between episodes, just trying to keep this thing running, keep feeding it cobblestone. get it to produce more diamonds. Whoop, <laughs> and suck that power right down. Okay, well, anyway, we're gonna go ahead and end the episode here. We achieved our goals and progress was made. <laughs> Did some exploring found a cool dome so maybe next time uh, we'll try and make the sea moth to go check out that dome and see what it's all about uh, I don't think I'm ready for the guardians just yet <laughs> at least not with like a cobble axe I need better weapons and at least an upgrade for my diving suit and stuff so anyway, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Thank you for watching, and bye-bye.